Construction of the Pualugu Multipurpose Dam is the first ever hydro system in Ghana. Construction has already started after the parliament has approved the development of the project. Before we go deep into this video, take a minute to subscribe to our channel for more impressive videos like this. The approval of the project, which has already been launched by the president, has been delayed by parliamentarians who question the cost of the project. This project is expected to cost the government 1 billion US dollars and will be undertaken by Sanro Hydro Power, a Chinese construction firm. This Pualugu multipurpose dam is located on the White Water on the boundary of Upper East and Northeast region. The president noted that the project is the biggest single project that any government has had ever made in the northern part of Ghana and it is expected to project sustained growth and development. I'll be cutting the sword for the commencement of one of the important infrastructural projects that are taking place in the north. He also explained that the project consists of a three main component including a dam with an elevation of 165 meters maximum and a reservoir of 350 square kilometers. The dam will comprise of a hydroelectric power generation house consisting of two turbines with 16 megawatts of installed capacity and 16.5 megawatts of firm continuous capacity as well as an irrigation scheme of about 25 hectares of land. Construction of this dam will serve as a separate a receptor to hold large volumes of water spillage from the neighboring Burkina Faso Barri Dam for irrigation purposes and generation of electricity and will also be a permanent solution to the problem of spillage from the Barri Dam. This project is expected to boost the growth of Ghana's economy and also to increase solar energy power supply to enhance agricultural production thereby reducing imports and ensuring perennial flood control that disturbs the, the region and this will also enhance electricity supply and augmenting farming activities through irrigation scheme. I think that if we do it and we do it successfully, we will have empowered our economy, we will have taken it onto a much stronger level and all of us will benefit from that. The contractor is expected to complete the construction work within 15 months from the day of commencement. This project will not only secure employment and generate revenue for the people in the community, but will also make the people truly feel a part of having a hand in the part that transforms their fortunes. If you like impressive videos like this, do subscribe to our channel. But don't forget to like this video and leave your comments below. Also visit our channel for more or such impressive videos. Stay tuned and watch out for our next video. Bye-bye.